Hi guys, welcome back to Twinning Beauty. I'm Jamie and um, as you can see, I am missing my twin. Um, I wanted to make a video though because I've been dying to play around with this ABHX Alyssa Edwards palette. Um, I have played around with it a little bit, but I haven't actually tried too many of the shades just yet. So today I'm actually going to make a look with this uh, blue shade here, which is called Dream It. Um, I actually had um, to get help from my husband to pick a color because I'm like, I love all of them, so it's really hard to choose. So now I'm just kind of going to base a look around that color. So stick around if you would like to see the look that I come up with. I'm going to bring you in nice and close here so you can kind of see what I'm doing. So the first thing I'm going to do is um, I've already... Um, Prime my eyelids so they're ready to go. I didn't set it with a powder though. And I guess I'm just gonna go first in, um, actually, I'm gonna just go straight in with that blue shade. I think my plan is gonna be to do a halo eye, so we'll see how this comes out. So I'm gonna take that blue shade, the blending brush here. Take it in the outside corner and blend it in. That one comes out a little bit. Ah, oh, it's blue. Kind of like a blue, almost purplish tint to it. It's very pretty though. So far, I haven't really had any fallout just yet. Is good. All right, there's that blue shade on. And then I do think I'm going to take, let's see, I'm going to take this dark kind of, dark kind of purplish color here and that I'm just going to stick in the inside and outside corner to kind of darken it up a little bit. Oh my god, that is not the same shade. Oh my god, that comes off a lot lighter than it looks. And I guess we're gonna turn this blue definite, definitely into purple now. I guess since that one didn't work out, I'm gonna do <laughs> back rolls and just add that little brown into it. Actually, you know what? <sighs> Scratch that. I'm going to take the black shade, um, which is Beast. I'll just try it out. <laughs> like a good matte black. And I'm just kind of stamping it down there. I'm going to blend it in, and then I'm going to take a fluffier brush and actually blend that. purple than I thought it was going to turn out, but I don't hate it. And then I am going to take, but I think I'm going to cut the crease first, and then I am going to take this um, DD, the DDC um, shimmer shade, and I'm going to put that right in the middle. And I'm just going to take a flat brush like that to cut my crease. I'm just put a very little bit, and I'm, I am using my Luscious Angel Eyes Primer. I actually really like this to cut the crease. I think it looks good. It looks good. A little bit off. And then I'm just going to just cut the very center. And then 
I'm sure it'll work just wetting a brush, but I just don't know why I just, I love using my finger. So I'm gonna try that first and just see how it looks. Ooh. Oh, this is not the color I was expecting, but I was really surprised with this. That is really pretty. For my third dip on my finger. So I notice a lot of these colors seem to come off a lot lighter than they look in the pan, which I'm not mad about. I don't mind it. Especially since they blend really well so far. They just have a lot of pigmentation too. And I really haven't gotten any fallout either, which is really good. I don't usually do my base makeup before eyeshadow, but I thought I would this time. And yeah, I really like that. I think what I'm gonna do is Maybe put that pink in my lower lash line and then that shimmer pink in like the inside bottom portion. See how that turns out. Okay, so I was thinking about doing pink on the lower lash line. I no longer think I should do that. What I think I'm gonna do is take more of that Dream It, that blue, and then just pop the pink on the inside corner. So I'm gonna take more of this blue sheen. Keep it as close as I can to my lower lash line. I'm gonna take a little small brush. Pick up that Beyond, which is that shimmer pink shade. Ooh, I do like that. cotton around with a little bit of micellar water. Ran out of wipes, so I'm just gonna clean up that line there. All right, I'm liking the shape. Everything's looking pretty good. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and try to do the same thing on the other eye and I'll be right back. All right guys, this is the final look. Um, came out a lot more purple than I thought it was going to, but I actually really, really like it. Um, this palette, of course, is a normal ABH formula. Everything blends really well. A lot of pigmentation. Um, I have the Modern Renaissance palette, and that's actually one of my favorite palettes, and I would probably compare it to that one. Um, there was no fallout, really. I don't have anything underneath my eye, which, um, with bright colors, that's always a possibility. So, um, yeah, I really, really love this palette. Uh, I can't wait to create more looks with it. Uh, don't forget to, uh, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Um, make sure you subscribe. Follow us on Instagram at underscore 20 beauty underscore. And we will see you in the next video. All right, bye.